<laughs> We're talking golf a little bit, too. So it's all about being active. So yeah. welcome back to Good Day. Mm -hmm. It's the simplest form of mu movement, and you can socialize while mm -hmm. doing it. Simply going for a walk. I love to do it. If you don't know where to start or have anyone to walk with, the City of Toledo can solve that. Director of the City of Toledo Pop-Up Walks, Jacqueline Johnson, and Karen Randy Wilkins join us with how you could take advantage of this program. Good morning, ladies. Thanks good for being morning, here today. Good morning. morning. We were just talking about all the good places to yes. walk. So we're talking, we were talking Ottawa Park. Oh, my God. Love Ottawa Park. Mm -hmm. It's one of the parks we use for our kickoff. Mm -hmm. And also, I tell anybody, it, it's a sleeper, but it'll put you through the trails. <laughs> uh, it is one of the best walking trails in the city to me. Okay, got to put it on the list. You mentioned <laughs> that it's a kickoff. So you all have a program that mm -hmm. you're getting started up here. Tell us about this program. Uh, so Let's Get Moving has been with the City of Toledo Parks and Youth Services Department for about three years. Mm -hmm. And um, actually we won an award for it. But it's a walking program that we try to garner the community and our residents out to highlight the health benefits of walking. Mm -hmm. We have a number of partners that help us with this program, mm -hmm. which is really, really cool. We have guest walkers, prizes. It's just a really great time to get everyone out, get them moving, get them excited about health benefits of walking, mm -hmm. which are uh, numerous. Yeah, and some people might think, well, why walk? It's low impact. I'm really not breaking a sweat. Maybe I should run, but there's a lot of health benefits to this, correct? Absolutely. I mean, it's much more gentle on your joints mm -hmm. and those of us who are getting a little bit on in years you know I mean it's just a it's a much healthier way I think to get your heart rate up and as Jacqueline Matt mentioned some of our parks have got some great little hills and so there's a good way to get your cardiac in and um, yeah. And you can talk at friends at the same time. Yeah, you're, so not out, you're not so out of breath. Right, right. Yeah. So, and this is a good way for people to socialize and meet new people too, correct? Absolutely. And they say loneliness is a killer, right? Mm -hmm. So we want people to get out and make a community with their activity. Mm -hmm. it's, and we're getting with the weather is real nice. You oh, know? beautiful. This is beautiful the, walking weather. Beautiful. So tell us um, when this gets started and how, how you are kicking it off. Well, we're doing a pop-up. We're a pop-up tomorrow. Okay. And we're going to be at Close Park. We're specifically trying to look at our pocket parks, our city parks, okay. um, getting uh, our neighbors in the surrounding area to come out and have other people from other communities come out and take a look at these parks. So mm -hmm. we're really excited about that. It'll be at 6 o'clock tomorrow evening. Mm -hmm. We have Mercy Health Partners coming out, Mercy Community Nurses. They'll do blood pressure and diabetes screenings. Oh, wow. So we love our partnership with all of our great P uh, community partners. We have Mercy Area Office on Aging. Mm -hmm. We have the Zeff Center. Uh, we have the Lucas County P Health Department. Mm -hmm. We have um, just a number of partners. And if anybody's interested in being a partner, <laughs> let me know. <laughs> I love this because it's, it's really uh, promoting health within the city. Mm -hmm. And you get an opportunity, like you said, because loneliness is something that's mm -hmm. impacting so many people across the board no matter the age uh, but are there themes to the walks as well will you all mm -hmm. be talking about specific subjects what what are some of those well with the pop-up we're really focusing on diving deep into health and this month is minority health month mm -hmm. and it's for April and so we have asked the expert with uh, Mercy Health where they can call in and do a zoom and learn some different things where that's the, uh, you know different health uh, that affects minority uh, our minority community mm -hmm. and then in May we will have mental health. We'll focus, dive deep into our mental health and bring in some of our mental health partners and they can also work with Ask the Expert with that. So I think just the, the notion of just getting moving Mm -hmm. in general you know you got to start somewhere, somewhere. Yes, absolutely. And, and I love that you are doing the free screenings too for people to know their numbers because right. I think first of all a lot of people don't know their numbers right uh, so know where you are and then while you're there take some steps yes. literal mm -hmm. steps toward just making healthier choices because it might just be walking, but it might be enough to br start bringing those numbers Absolutely. Down. And you see so many you studies know? about walking mm -hmm. and how it reduces X, Y, and mm -hmm. Z. And we all have to walk. So, and we want to continue to walk as we... What did you use? Get up in years, get a little bit more seasoned. Yeah, seasoned, I like seasoned. that word okay. better. Seasoned, like that seasoned word is a little better. Yeah. Uh, so is this open to all or is this just the city? Uh, who is this open to? Anybody who wants to join us. We welcome everyone from all across the community, outside of the city, it doesn't matter. And we really are encouraging people to get out into their city parks. So there's 130 city parks. A lot of people don't even know they're there. You drive by them every day. Mm -hmm. And they're, the beauty of them is they're in their neighborhoods. And we're doing a lot to actually 
uh, upgrade them, and we've replaced a lot of the walking paths are, mm -hmm. are in the process. So, I mean, you don't have to drive someplace to go walking. You could just walk out, maybe a couple blocks, okay. and get on a trail. Might not be a very long trail because there's some some pretty small parks. Sure. Yeah. It gets just you out laps. in just the, na just in the just neighborhood. Just yeah. with that. And start somewhere. Exactly. I agree. Yeah, so uh, first opportunity to do that tomorrow. You said 6 o'clock, right? 6 o'clock, closed park. Meet us there. Um, 5.30, the health partners will be there. So come know your numbers. It'll be a great time. It's great after dinner, too. Have something to eat and then walk it off. Mm -hmm. You know? <laughs> it helps. It helps to keep everything moving. And it this, really does. And this is, a, <laughs> this is a full schedule. So uh, where can people see uh, the schedule for the times and dates for uh, They can just um, do a, a Google search, Let's Get Moving. Uh, the city's website um, is connected to the website. We already have the new calendar up. We'll be doing three pop-up, one in May and then one in June. Mm -hmm. It's, it's going to be about the third Tuesday of um, each one of those months. Okay. So okay. our walks will be on Tuesdays. And then in the meantime, just walk on your own and make some friends at these pop-ups and then, you know, just keep it going. Keep it going. Yeah. It's going to be a good time. You, Very good. Uh, Great time. It is. It sounds good. Ladies, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.